Well, it's become a bit of a tradition for me to take the latest and greatest graphics cards and uh, compare them against their peers or against their uh, predecessors in terms of their physical stature. So this is the very latest from NVIDIA, the GTX 580. So this is an MSI card. This is a reference card. So every 580 that is available immediately after the launch of this GPU will be pretty much exactly like this one. Okay, so I'm just giving you sort of a couple of views of the card here. If you want to see the whole thing in closer detail, you can always check out the unboxing. So we're going to do a length comparison here. And uh, in order to facilitate that, we're going to flip the cards over onto their backs. So we're going to compare it against the GTX 480, which uh, you may already see some similarities with in terms of the overall layout of the PCB. In fact, there are some parts that are uh, quite clearly just, you know, reused. You know, like here looks pretty similar to here. And uh, as a matter of fact, the layout of the RAM chips as well as the GPU is uh, quite, quite similar as well. So uh, what we're going to discover in just a moment is that these two cards happen to be, this is the 480 right now, just over 10 and a half inches in length each. So we're going to have a look at the GTX 580 and it is exactly the same length. Now how does this compare to the latest and greatest from the red team? Bearing in mind the date of this video, so uh, not that I'm saying anything about the latest and greatest from ATI, but this is the 5870 which is currently the latest and greatest and it is just a hair over 11 inches itself with that uh, shroud, Batmobile shroud thing it's got going on, like 11 and uh, like in a, whatever that is, an eighth of an inch or something like that. So that is the uh, physical layout of these cards. In terms of connectors, the GTX 580 has exactly the same connectors as the GTX 480. So you can see that from the back, they look pretty much exactly the same except that one has fingerprints all over it from being used on various test benches over and over and over again and the other one is quite clean because I'm just getting started with it. So, thank you for checking out my length comparison of the GTX 580 and the GTX 480 and don't forget to subscribe to Linus Tech Tips. Thank you for watching.